you guys and welcome to my channel and to today's video um so today obviously i have a full face of makeup already um so the last step i'm going to be doing is applying the kvd beauty mod con liquid gel contour um this is in the shade light medium neutral 70 sorry it was a bit of a mouthful all of that um but yeah obviously as you can see i've got loads of makeup on but i just need to add like the contour which brings like loads of definition and stuff to my face and this is what i've been using lately i'm really enjoying it actually so i just wanted to dedicate a little video so if you're interested then please keep watching okay so if you've watched any of my videos before you'll know how much i love the clinique contour stick um so i was really interested to try this obviously because it's a liquid gel and just to see like how i get on with it um i do still prefer sticks sorry about that um i do still prefer sticks just because i'm quite like a creamy product lover but this has been working really well and since i got it i thought i might as well just stick to using it and i do really like the results so i'm gonna go ahead and apply it and just give you like show you how it applies and give you kind of like my review so the first thing I actually noticed about this is how lightweight it is and you only need a little bit as well. So I'm kind of just going to take it down just about there because when I start to blend this out it little really does go a long way. So when applying this literally feels like water, like it's so so lightweight. Like I said I use cream contour and I'm used to it being thick like super thick so this is very very lightweight and it blends out really lightweight as well um i think that's like just the perks of having like a liquid gel so yeah it goes on like a liquid and then as you start to blend it in you can really feel that it's a bit more jet like jelly it moves around really nicely as well so it doesn't get like muddy like some uh, powder products do um so yeah i'm just going to go ahead and apply a little just where i would usually pop my contour And this shade is perfect for me as well, by the way. So like I said, it is light, medium, neutral. So the shade is 70, as I would have already said. Um, but yeah, I like a really neutral contour and also like light, medium as well is perfect for me. And it blends out really nicely as well. It's got some nice earthy undertones. Doesn't make me look like too warm and orange. Um, so yeah, just taking any contour brush, I'm just going to start to pat it into the skin and work it in just so you can see what it looks like. Okay, so this is the contour all blended in um as you'll see it has blended in so effortlessly with the rest of my makeup it doesn't like disrupt anything that's underneath it or go muddy or patchy um i really like it the only reason i like cream a bit more is because i tend to have dry skin um, and this has dried down like completely matte whereas with cream you kind of still have a bit just feels a little bit more hydrating um but yeah i'm re really like the outcome i'm gonna go and put like a nice hydrating spray over the top so it won't you know cause me any bother or anything and i think i feel like it's like a really light sun kissed kind of look as well and just really easy to use and blend in um the only thing i will say is probably to apply it in parts so like i just literally applied it to forehead nose cheeks chin um but because it's a liquid it does dry down quicker than a, a cream so yeah just to keep it like nice and like more blendable i was just pop it on maybe one side and start blending it in just to quickly finish i will touch on price so this retails for 22 pounds which i think is about right for like a mid to higher end contour price um the clinique one i get is i think it might be about t between 22 to 25 pounds um so yeah i'll be happy to pay for this oh, i don't know what that noise was but as i was saying yeah i'll be happy to pay for this again and it is just a really really nice product um, if you've got any questions about anything then just pop it in the comments also please subscribe to my channel check me out on tiktok and instagram and i'll see you in the next video